This would be the part of the video where I claim fair use, but the Berne Convention says that the nation of origin is important, and Japan doesn't really consider review and commentary fair use. Whatever, support the official release and all, I'm still gonna do this. Hello and welcome to Matu's Random Top List. Opinions change over time, and my old Super Sentai theme top list was outdated and seriously overrated. Seriously, people, I was still using Windows Movie Maker. How does it continue to get the most views of all the videos still set to public on this channel? I have content that I put way more effort into that you should be watching instead. Sorry that I still don't have a lot to say about some of these, and I have to speed up the footage and cut it when I'm done talking to avoid content ID because honestly I have no shortage of trouble with Toei, Saban, and sometimes even Avex. Without further ado though, here's my top 20 Super Sentai theme songs. Numbers 21, 20, and 19. Dynaman, Dingy Man, and Change Man. I originally dismissed most of the Showa era theme songs for how generic they were, especially the earliest ones, but I feel as though that wasn't fair. And it sort of doesn't help that I missed a few gems along the way. But these songs honestly aren't them, and they sure as heck aren't the dynamite to change these songs' batteries. Oh, that does not work, okay, but oh well. Number 18, Joe Kaiser. I originally put this higher on my list, but I came to realize that I was just biased because it was one of my favorite shows. Something that wasn't the case for Go Under's opening, I assure you. This song is a far cry from being the greatest treasure in the universe. Number 17, Q Ranger with Lucky Star. Much like the show itself, this one was just okay, honestly. Yosha not like me. Number 16, Akiba Ranger. Delightfully nerdy, but you'd be delusional to think it'd be any higher on my list. Number 15, Go Busters with Busters Ready Go and Morphin Movin Buster Ship. Go Busters is also higher on my list due to personal bias. These songs aren't ready to go and morph their way to the number one spot, though. Number 14, Kelluger. O Ranger theme might be called Ole O Ranger, but if there was ever a Sentai theme that would make me shout Ole, then it would be this one instead. But you won't be surprised when you hear that these dinos aren't dancing their way to the number one spot anytime soon. Number 13, Gal Ranger. I previously put Abba Ranger's theme song on this list before, but honestly I realized that it wasn't actually that good. And again, I was just biased, but this time it was because I usually like Masaki Endo's work. And it certainly doesn't help that I came to realize that this was the song that could have easily better screamed Raging Dino Guts, but it's definitely not King of These Beasts. Number 12, Denji Sentai Mega Ranger. This one's definitely an improvement over Denji Man's, but it's not winning this game anytime soon. Number 11, Time Ranger. The start of the song immediately catches your attention, but the rest is a bit more generic, but still good enough to make the list again. Time might be on their side, but that's not going to stop me from putting it at the spa. Number 10, Jetman. This was one of the gems that I passed over before, and let me tell you, I feel kind of dumb for not noticing it before. But it's not the only one, and it's definitely more Birdman than Superman. Number 9, Die Ranger. This. How did I not even include this on my previous list? It is the least generic of the songs that I passed up for it, and it's catchy as heck and definitely deserves the spot, if not only because the rest are better, meaning that it quite sadly is not the greatest. Number 8, Kaku Ranger. Once again, all I can really say is that if there was ever a song that exudes pop culture ninjas, oh, wait a minute, when you mean it's pop ninjas, as in Ninja Vanish. Really? Well, anyway, this one would definitely be the one, but it's still more Nani Jaw than Ninja. Number 7, Hurricane with Hurricane Jer Sanjo. Definitely catchier and more modern than Kagu Rangers, but it's not blowing anyone away anytime soon. Number 6, Ninja. I suppose it's only fitting that my opinion of this song would once again bunch the Ninja Sentai together. 
There's the ninjas that don't hide, and the song is fittingly boisterous and mixes modern and traditional just as much as the ninjas themselves do. They might be trying to be the last ninja, but they're not becoming first on this list. Number 5, Tokyuger. This is definitely a theme song that makes me want to be not late to see it, but it's definitely not the last train to number 1. Number 4, Deck Arranger. When I put this in a certain other song on the old list, little did I know at the time that it was actually made by what would soon become one of my favorite Japanese bands, Psychic Glover, with me enjoying their work on these two songs, as well as the work of Yu-Gi-Oh, Bakugan, Vanguard, Digimon, and Transformers. That said, their cover of Justifies from Kamen Rider Flies was a bit of a letdown in my opinion, as they didn't cover it in their own style. Style, and this isn't the song that's going to be the one that arrests the number one spot. Hint, hint. Number 3, Shinkinger. This is the other Psychic Lover song, and it's even better in my opinion, but it's not slashing through the number one spot anytime soon. Number 2, Injin Sentai Goanger. This is the song that took the number one spot before, and for good reason. But this time, it's not getting the checker flag. Number 1, Lupin Ranger vs. Pat Ranger. Being that this is the first Sentai series to stars two Sentai, this one is actually a mashup of two different theme songs, Lupin Ranger Spin the Dial and Chase You a Pat Ranger. Neither are really great on their own. Sort of like how the core Lupin Rangers are more important than the plot and have their own mythos in the theme song while the Pat Rangers don't really have any unique mythos to them. I mean, heck, they keep talking about the Lupin Rangers, but they don't mention the Ganglers in their theme song. There's also the fact that the Pat Rangers characters are more interesting than the Lupin Rangers are. Though time will tell if the inevitable merging of the teams winds up improving them both as much as this song does for its two components. Number one spot, this is your warning. By the authority of the global police, you're under arrest. Well, that just about does it for this time. Until next time, forevermore, adieu.